It's beer o'clock on Real Ale Craft Beer. Today we've got a beer from Vuru, and it's the Kul, and it's a classic Baltic lager coming in at 4.8% ABV. All the information is around the neck of the bottle on a very small label. I like the, the classic style bottle they use. The very, can I say classic? No, not classic. The individual style bottle that they use. Black bottle cap. Without further ado, Let's get this beer out into a glass and see what we get. It's still quite warm here in the UK. Or maybe it's I've been doing a lot of running around and I fancy a lager. Here we go then. So if you want to order this beer, the link is in the description box of the video for beersofeurope.co.uk. It's a direct link that will take you to this very beer on their website so you can order along if you live in the UK. It's very easy to do now. Um, I've been working with Beers of Europe really hard on this and, and just getting individual links and yeah, it's all very good, all very good. Uh, so beersofeurope.co.uk, link is in the description box of the video. Thank you very much. On with the beer review, we've got a one finger white head, good levels of carbonation. Slight haziness going on here with this lager. But yeah, straw coloured as usual, as per usual with this lager. Oh, this, I'm not sure if you can see, lots of sediment floating around in the glass. Look at that. Right, let's get the aroma. Mm, just, yeah, just... My mind has been swayed by lager. It just, it's happened over the last two, three years, really. I say two years. When I'm looking for good quality lagers, pilsners, vice beers. And this smells pretty decent. It smells pretty decent, this. Slight kind of grainy, lemony, spicy aroma. Let's dive in. Cheers, everybody. Oh, lots of stinging nettle. Lots of stinging nettle flavours coming through. Spicy, peppery. Oh, that's very nice. Very nice. Carbonation pushes the beer on the inside of the mouth, releasing more of that flavour. It's ultra drinkable. It's ultra refreshing. To be honest, it's slipping down. It really is slipping down. Not overly cold, I put it in the fridge about an hour or two ago, so it's a nice temperature, it's not overly cold. I'm still able to pull all of these flavours out of the beer. But that's good. It's really good. Of course, for that. I'm not going to call it a premium lager. I don't know too much about Viru. They're probably Estonia's number one um, beer company. They're probably owned by a great big conglomerate somewhere around the world. It doesn't say though, just info at verobeer.com. Uh, it's all in English as well, enjoy responsibly. Da -da -da, drink away. <laughs> um, so the ingredients are water, malted barley, hops, and of course they haven't put the yeast on, but of course there's yeast in there. Uh, a classic Baltic lager. I've never been to Estonia. It's a place where I would like to go and visit. Um, I know they like their beer out there. Um, I know a brewery out there called Puchlala. Puchlala Brewery. Um, P-O-J something after that. And they, they produce some terrific, terrific beer. I met them when I was in Norway. 
um, I was at the Bergen Craft Beer Festival and they were there in attendance and I was speaking to the head brewer and he was just talking about his passion for, for beer and Estonian beer and, and, and changing the mindset of the Estonian beer drinker. And that's what I suppose we're all here to do really, is to, is to try and move away a little bit from complete mass produced beers and try something a little bit different. This, of course, Viru cooled, it's a little bit different. Should we rate it? Looks really good. Nice aroma. It's almost got like a, a banana-y kind of clovey aroma from the yeast. A lemon drop, pear drop. Mm. But no problem, 4.8% ABV, three, four, five, six bottles of this on the weekend. Absolutely fantastic. I like it. Viru cooled. And look out for the, I've got a white IPA coming as well very, very shortly. Uh, when, it, when I say very, very shortly, I mean it's my next review. <laughs> I'm about to get it out the fridge and review it. So look out for the white IPA from Viru. Uh, again, the beers are available from beersofeurope.co.uk. My rating for this, yeah, it's a solid lager. It's a solid lager. It's a 7 out of 10. 7 out of 10 from Real Ale Craft Beer. Please put your comments in the comments box. Subscribe to our daily beer and food reviews. Give us a big fat thumbs up. Boom. Cheers.